It is going to be a delicious meal right now. Riff's Fine Street Food has a great opportunity for us right now because the food trucks are taking over the farmer's market on uh, Friday night. It's, we're really excited about it. BJ Luffback with us right now to tell us about it. And we're always excited. Uh, anytime we get to do something at the fire, farmer's market, it's, it's a special place. It holds a special place in our heart. A lot of cool things have happened there for food trucks as we've come about. And so it's, it's, a, it's a nice thing to embrace. A lot of cool things happening at the farmer's market. They're, they're extending their hours. They're on, on weekends. Weekends and uh, and now we have the the sound stadium open up nearby. Yeah, we're excited about that because of course that is Friday night, mm -hmm. and so you've got ballpark food for us. Yes. We're making some corn dogs, but they're kind we're of upscale making, corn dogs. You know, we can't. We could make corn dogs, but I'm in a food truck. We got to we got to food truck it up a little yeah. bit. And so what we're doing is we're we're actually stuffing our hot dogs inside some jalapenos. Nice. And then putting the corn. You know, who likes jalapenos and cornbread? There's those are just matches Perfect. made in heaven. Why don't you put an egg inside? We've got some pancake. Uh, uh, mix here okay. to make it really easy. A little bit of cornmeal, and if you start mixing that in, I'm going to go ahead and hit this with some water. Okay. And we're going to make a nice little cornbread batter here. While you're doing that, uh, what I did is I, I split long ways a, a jalapeno here, put some cream cheese in it, and then stuffed a stick through the stem end. And now I'm going to hit the uh, the hot dog in there. Okay. And when you have a nice little batter there, you think I need a little more water? Squeeze, I think maybe a little bit more water. I wasn't paying attention to you. <laughs> Yeah, I think I do. Need a this is a more. very exact, precise I, measuring I that we're doing that here. You know, just make it so that it's dippable. That's right. right exactly. Okay. We, we want it a little bit thick because we want it to coat this uh, the the jalapeno as well. And I'm going to kind of smash this in here a little bit. And when you start coming around, what do you think? Very, very close. Okay. Just going to give us a little bit you room. Just got to eyeball it, right? Absolutely. You got well, some great memories of ballpark food. I do. You know, it, I, I'm I'm not a huge baseball fan, but I'm a huge going to the baseball. That's perfect, right okay. there. I'm a huge going to the baseball park fan, and uh, I have vivid memories of uh, where I grew up in Detroit, going to Tiger Stadium with my grandfather and my dad, and I can see the corn dog in my hand as I'm looking across the field. Oh and so wow! It's a it's a cool thing it's to a see. Great memory. So we're going to let a bit little bit of this batter drip off of here, and then just put it right inside our hot oil. Well, it's super and hot oil. It's it, we're we're at about 360 370 here and we're going to just hope wow. that uh, that we don't melt through our uh, that our, our our cream cheese doesn't come through. Now, you notice how I just gave a little spin there before yeah. it went in. That's what gets it nice that smooth exterior and that oil is so hot right now that we're going to get this brown very very quickly. So you want to really pay attention. As Absolutely you're doing that. and you notice I'm just keeping it spinning. I'm not going wicked wild here. This is not something necessarily want to have the kids do but they can sure. be involved in helping to stuff them Look and voila we've got a beautiful That's corn dog fantastic. ready to go. That's great. Yeah. You got several different varieties over here too. Tell me what you've mixed. Well, we did. We, of course, you gotta you gotta do bacon in here in some way. We took so that's bacon. This is down front. Yeah, we cooked, pre cooked it a little bit, dipped it in the corn batter, and, and dipped it in there. We've got oh, cheese fun. over here. Um, regular string old cheese. corn dogs. Yeah, string, string cheese on a stick. Very very batter simple. Batter it up. That's yep. good. Throw it in it, and and just make sure you get it right golden brown and, and just before it starts to melt and it'll be ooey and gooey on the inside. Maybe nice. a little pizza sauce uh, on the outside oh, or something. Idea. Oh yeah, yeah, delicious. Absolutely yeah. delicious. Oh, that sounds so fun. All right, so tell me when you're going to be out there on Friday night. Friday night, 5 to 8 p.m., and, and this is a whole farmer's market experience. There's going to be 10 food trucks out there, but you can go all the way through the farmer's market. All the vendors will be open in there. We love those guys. We hope they love us, and it's just a, a wonderful thing. So if you're going to the game, stop by, tailgate with us, uh, then head in. If you're not going to the game, just come and, and, uh, and, and enjoy, and you'll be able to hear the crowd scream for the, uh, for the sounds as they're uh, trouncing whoever they're playing this week. I forgot to find out. Uh, <laughs> Doesn't matter. Our Doesn't sounds are going to win. They're going to win. All right. Thank you so much, BJ, for Thank being you. with us today. This is recipe number 5338. Head on over and see BJ working hard inside Riff's Fine Street Food Truck over at the Farmer's Market this Friday. Now.